H2K Infosys provides world-class online IT training, staffing and software testing solutions to customers worldwide. H2K Infosys supports 100% job-oriented training, hands-on project work, cloud test lab, resume preparation and review, mock interviews, robust syllabus, one-time pay, lifetime access to live classes and videos. H2K Infosys has won the trust of thousands of students worldwide. For free demo class, visit h2kinfosys.com. Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we are going to talk about the difference between equals and double equals in Java. Now what's the difference between equals and double equals in Java? Equals method is used for checking the equality of two objects and double equals which is basically a relational operator used for comparing primitives and objects as well. Now when used on an object reference it checks if uh, both the reference points to the same object or not. Now let's see an example uh, in practical and, and understand more about the concept behind the equals and double equals. So let me just go ahead and create a new class out here. Say uh, equals double equals. Right? Just go ahead and create a main method, public static void main. And let, let me just get started by creating a new string out here and name it as uh, peter.var. Just create a variable. Uh, likewise, I'll just go ahead and create another variable as peter1 with the same value as peter. Okay. So now we're going to use uh, both equals and double equals on these two references. So let's get started with uh, equals. So how do we go with that? So let's say system.out.println peter.equals peter1. Okay. Likewise, we would uh, do with double equals also. And let me just quickly run this example and show you that what's the output of this. And here we go. When you say equals, it basically checks that if this reference has, well, what, what's the value of this particular object and what's the value of this object as well. So this is what equals does it. It internally goes and checks the value uh, between these two objects, okay? Likewise, if I just go ahead and use uh, Peter equals equals Peter one, and let's run this code again to see what's the output. And you would see the value as false reason because it basically checks whether Peter and Peter are they both pointing to the same object or not uh, Peter one sorry but it is not because Peter is pointing to one object and Peter one is also pointing to another object so there's a reason we have got an answer as false right thank you folks uh, see you in the next video